Okay, on the flip side of the coin, you don't want to have your back against the ropes, obviously, but you want to put your opponent against the ropes. Okay, so for example, if Sean here is my dummy, he's going to accommodate me today. When I move forward and he's moving backwards, if he moves to the right, I got to cover him. He moves to the left, I'm going to cover him. So it looks like I'm moving in a zigzag fashion, always pressing my opponent back into the ropes. What I don't want to do is if he's circling to the left, for example, I don't want to do this. Chasing this guy all around the ring, all right, and wasting my time. So for the drill for today, we're going to always come back to the center, all right. Sean's going to start moving backwards, I'm going to follow him. And as he moves to the side, I always stay in front of him. And coming forward, pushing him back to the ropes. We walk back to the center, and we go again. He moves to the side, he moves to the side, and I keep coming forward to put him against that corner or against the ropes. Okay, Sean, let's see it. Good. Back in the center. And again. Beautiful. Good. One more time. Perfect. Good. And that's some basic ring management skills.